Hi Snooker fans, Curtis Braithwaite here for DapperSnooker.com I'm with my Frames Academy colleague Jimmy Robertson after his stunning 10-6 victory over Rod Lawler in the final qualifying round of the World Championships. Jimmy, but before we start the interview, I think there's only one thing you want to say, son. Oosh! That's <laughs> so a little bit of a banter thing when he wins the match. But Jim, tremendous ball, so, so happy for you. Not only because, obviously, you're my colleague and close friend, but, I mean, it's been a battle for you at some parts this season. It's really tremendous to see you get over the line today, pal. Thanks a lot, I appreciate that. Um, yeah, no, it was a real tough battle over the two days. Um, as you feel, yesterday coming out of 5-4 was sort of, um, it was a massive frame winning that frame to go 5-4. Uh, so we started over again today, and it's basically 1-0 nil best of 11 to him. So um, just got a clear head again this morning and, and come out and started getting a bit of ball run today as well, which was nice. Yeah. Because I never get any ball run, ever. <laughs> That's not what MD says. <laughs> That's not what MD says. But, um, no, no, I just stuck in there today and, and sort of, it was a really tough match with Rod. You know what you're getting. Yeah. So um, I'm just really happy to come through that. Yeah, tremendous, pal. I mean, all of us are so over overly delighted for you, pal. I mean, is there any preference who you'd like to, to play out there? Would you like a crack at Ronnie, um, someone like that? Um, Ronnie's yeah. probably the easiest draw. <laughs> um, no, they're, they're all going to be tough draws, aren't they? So there's a couple probably that, that, that you want more than others. I'm not going to say any names. But, yeah, um, yeah. but anyone who you get, it's going to be a tough draw or whatever. So I've just got to go there and, and enjoy it and try and relax and, and play some snooker. Absolutely, Paul. Well, let's just hope that at least they keep uh, you and the boss man, Marco, for apart from each other. Cause we don't, we don't need that again after last year. Yeah. But um, yeah, Jim, like I said, Paul, very, very well done anyway, mate. I'll let you go and uh, relax and take it easy and respond to all those messages. That's fine. Me happy. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's it.